Alrighty guys, it's your boy Chris, aka The Metal Vlogger here. Tonight's gonna be really sick. Um, first off, rocking the uh, Vorod shirt and the Volvo Dina shorts. Um, yeah, man, getting to see uh, Cloak and Dread tonight. Uh, hopefully get to, if everything goes playing, get to interview Cloak, so. It'll be a cool night. It's at Alabama Music Box in Mobile. Um, so super stoked. Always like that venue. It's a Wednesday night, so we'll see how the turnout is. Got Marilyn in the background ready to go. And uh, yeah, man, should be a really fun night. Uh, two bands, so shouldn't be that long of a show. And uh, yeah, I got about an hour drive, so we'll, we'll go ahead and head that way. All right, guys, you know what it is. White chocolate mocha frappuccino from Starbucks. It's my go-to drink. Try it, let me know what you think. It is delicious. <laughs> Alright, back to the vlog. Alrighty guys, as always, before we get any farther in the video, we're gonna go over the merch. I actually got a ton of merch. Um, so first we'll start out with the stuff I bought from Cloak. Um, got this huge flag, and then got you know the patch sticker and pin over there. And then I got this really sick black flame eternal shirt, dude. Super sick shirt. And then here's the back. Boom. Pretty sick. Before we go any further in the video, guys, my buddy that I work with knows I collect a ton of band stuff, metal stuff, hardcore stuff, whatever. And uh, he uh, gave me these old um, show posters from Vinyl Music Hall in Pensacola, man. Some of them are very old, but just wanted to shout out my, my, my coworker, my buddy, Steve. Appreciate you giving me these, bro. I'll definitely hold on to them and add them to my collection, bro. So thank you a lot. Downtown Mobile. And the lightning in the background, dude. That's so cool. Okay. Classic Metallica Slayer, Iron Maiden, uh, you know, all the classic 80s heavy metal, and then of course, you know, the second wave black metal um, bands like um, <laughs> Dissection, of course, uh, you know, early Burzum, early Mayhem, um, and then there's tons of other styles of music, you know, punk. I grew up on, on punk, so bands like Discharge and GBH, who I saw two nights ago. Um, yeah, tons of bands, but it's 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 the classics for us that are really. Alrighty, guys, made it to Mobile. Got the uh, you know whatever those are in the background. It's at uh, Alabama Music Box, like I said earlier. It's right down the street down there. Super stoked once again, man. Cloak and uh, Dread playing tonight, so should be a really good night. And uh, yeah, stoked to get in there and listen to some good music. I love Alabama Music Box. Probably my favorite venue over here in Mobile. And uh, yeah, dude, without further ado, let's go get inside. And uh, oh, there's some lighting in the background. Check it out. Oh yeah, last thing. Gotta show the fit once again, man, in case you skipped the beginning. There it is.
anyways, the Alabama Music Box bathrooms are <laughs> definitely have character. That's for sure. So <laughs> yeah, there's just a peek from the corner. Yeah. Got the whole face of that yeah, music buddy, All right, it's pretty hot out here, so I'm gonna make this quick, guys. So last night was amazing, dude. Um, Cloak and uh, Dreaded Alabama Music Box, they put on a great show, both bands. Um, just wanna start out by saying shout out to Cloak uh, for letting me interview them. I uh, got to interview Scott, their lead singer, that was awesome. Uh, also bought a, you know, a flag, uh, a shirt from them, you know, a patch, pin, all that good stuff. Um, I bought some good good merch from them, but also um, before I continue on, they, they they put on a sick show, dude. Like I think that gets slept on. Like bands just go out and play. They go out there. They had candles, incense, like the whole setup, dude, on stage. And you saw. I mean, if you watch the video, you saw that. It was super sick. Um, Dread, dude. They were awesome. They always put on a great show. Uh, they actually hooked me up with um like over a hundred dollars worth of merch dude like four posters a shirt a flag you know a koozie a patch like all types of stuff dude they hooked me up man shout out to dread they're always super cool and support what i do and i try to support them so they were super awesome um also alabama music box one of my favorite venues definitely my favorite venue uh, in mobile they actually hooked me up with the tour poster, the one that they, you know, you hang up, like that the venue usually have like in their glass. At the front of the venue, they gave me that, it's huge bro, like can cover a whole wall basically. Um, but yeah, I posted all that merch at the beginning of the video, that's what I do. If you guys don't watch all my videos, I usually post all the merch and stuff at the beginning just to be different, I don't know. And uh, yeah, um, it was just an awesome show, dude. Everybody was super nice, uh, ran into some friends. Um, all around just a great night dude super sick night all the bands were phenomenal go check them out once again shout out to dread for giving me all the merch shout out to cloak dude for letting me interview them um glad i was able to get merch from them and just it was an overall great night dude go support uh local bands go support local venues go support touring bands dude um you know just support your local scene bro you'd be surprised at how many friends and connections you'd make just by doing that um so i'm gonna end it off here guys i appreciate you guys for tuning in as always once again the gore rod shirt and uh yeah dude i will catch you guys in the next one like and subscribe and peace out bro